Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification game, et cetera, et cetera. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. They might hate the brothers, but today, purple and gold, I'm in the Lakers colors. Salute to all the Lakers fans out there. I give you a hell all the time. My brother's actually a Lakers fan, so that's probably why I be going in on them sometimes. Because, you know, it's a brotherly thing, so I get at my brother, but... Salute to Maserati Maine. So let's get to it. Yesterday I dropped a blog. I was talking about a couple things. That blog got taken down. It didn't get taken down by me. It got a copyright strike. They took it down because I had put a little footage from the Battle Academy in there. Stiz, you my brother. I can't watch you die. So I turned my head. They took the video down. It wasn't because of him. They've got Quarter Lab protecting their content. And if you use any of their clips too much of them, They'll take the video down, which is cool. I'm not even mad, you know what I'm saying? We spoke yesterday. He's going to try to get it uh, reloaded, but they take it down. I forgot how the YouTube streets be, but salute to Stiz. I did talk about a lot of things in that blog, so I'll just give you a couple of those subjects again because uh, the blog ain't here, so you need to, you know what I'm saying? There's some people who did not see it, you know what I mean? I had mentioned some battles that dropped last week. I talked about Rum Nitty versus Oppa. Make sure that you go watch that battle. What? I was looking for a quarter, picked the nickel up, and got mad? Yo, make sure y'all watch that battle. I will be doing a bar for bar breakdown. SP will be by on Thursday. He's got work this week. Um, battle Academy released a bunch of battles. They released uh, Danny Myers versus Top Floor Loot, uh, Steel versus Rosenberg Raw, and now Geechee Gotti versus News. Uh, make sure you check out all those battles. And um, I also talked about Summer Madness, potentially, you know, a battle or two that could potentially be uh, off the card of battles that you want to see. Um, and I'll just start there, you know, uh, with the Ultimate Rap League. Obviously, this has not been the greatest of years, but we know them and we have known them for a lot of dope moments and classic battles. Um, when you think about Summer Madness, you definitely think about one of the biggest cards of the year. Like, and here's why this card needs to be a success, you know what I'm saying? Well, it should be a success, or you hope for it to be a success, because I'm pretty sure it's going to be in front of a big crowd, you know. Hopefully not Atlanta. I, I, got, nothing against, I got nothing against Atlanta, but URL, y'all need to go somewhere else. Y'all need to go to Cali, y'all need to go to New Orleans, y'all need to go back to Houston. Y'all need to do some shit like that. Like Y'all need to go somewhere else with a different, or, or New York or something like that. But Atlanta, we love Atlanta, but the big crowds in Atlanta, it, it just... It just get a little different. Um, I was talking about Tay Rock versus Av yesterday, and that could be a potential battle because uh, Av been doing his thing for a while. Uh, I felt like he got some of the battles that he should have got, but I felt like some of the big names on big stages and big locations, he hasn't really, really, really got like that. I know he had Suge on a, um, Summer Madness, and he's had some other big battles, but I would like to see him versus Tay Rock could really, really bode well for both parties involved because obviously – used to be on the same team, both repping Cave Gang. Uh, Av, you know, ceremoniously left Cave Gang. Rock's been continuing to do his thing. And Rock is the logo, you know what I'm saying? Like, Rock is the logo. And a good battle between both of them could obviously get a lot of things off their chest and could also bode well for Battle Rap as a whole because uh, Battle Rap's doing real good right now. Matt Hoffa was just on the BET Awards doing my expert opinion on the red carpet. Now, I'll say this about Math. You know, math went through a lot. You know, there was people that, like, not all was not self-afflicted. You know what I'm saying? He did have some self-afflicted wounds in his career, too, but who has not? Uh, I respect the platform that he has built, and I respect the fact that he's gotten to the next level, taking it to hip-hop on national TV. He's not celebrated as much as he should be because he's not one of the end guys, and I get it. But if, there was, if this was other people, especially other people in battle rap, this would be talked about, like, on every single blog. But, you know, I get it. It's Mad Hoffa, but I, I definitely respect and uh, salute what he's doing, and I hope he continues to do that and uh, continues to shine. Speaking of shine, I did speak about shine yesterday. Oh, that was fire. Shine. Speaking of shine, I did speak about shine yesterday, so let's shine. Um, you know, he's someone who I would like to see on the Summer Madness. Like, I did a blog, Why They Need K-Shine Back ASAP, 
And regardless of where the situation is at right now, Battle Rap is losing without K-Shine. Because his energy, his stage presence, his big stage performances, his ability to battle on all three levels, that's missed. He can battle in the small rooms, he can battle on the Civil Wars type stage, and he can battle in the big cards, and he can battle on volumes, and he can do two on two. Way, 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 way too large of a star to not uh, have in the fold. You gotta have Shine in the fold. Now I hear both sides. I've heard that Shine was signed to a deal that paid him in advance for battles. You're getting paid in advance for battles, they're gonna want the service, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's just the way it goes. If you go on your job and you go on FMLA, and you're off for six weeks for whatever reason, when you get back to work, they still want you to do the job. You know what I'm saying? Hey, whoa, 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 I can go left, or oh, I can go right, you know what I'm saying? Like, wherever you try to stop me, oh, I can step back and pull up too. I got all three weapons. But uh, yeah, he's got a, so hopefully they work that shit out. Uh, like I said about yesterday, you know, it'd be hard to prepare, really prepare for battles that you're probably not gonna get paid for. Like, that would be kind of crazy. I don't know if I could do that. But, um, you know, best of luck to them. But here's some things that I was saying that I hope you know, that I hope people that we see, K-Shine is one. Got to see K-Shine because the lack of Sue Surf right now, obviously him being gone, that takes away from a lot of the star power. Now, when Surf has um, got locked up in other scenarios, Battle Rap has went on. There have still been big stages. There's still been big events. So am I saying that's an end-all, be-all? No, it's not an end-all, be-all. But I see Euros trying to, like, develop their stars quickly. You know what I mean? You have a... Uh, Safleya so Soul battling against Danny Myers. Now I seen people trying to tag me and at me yesterday talking about, oh, Danny Myers, he he backs off of uh, Gigi Gotti's card to get True Foe. Oh, this is I'm not True Foe. The shout out to my nigga True Foe, lucrative man. Um, he, to get Safleya so Soul, look at how they doing him. Well, you guys gotta understand, Danny Man Myers battles a lot of new niggas anyway. He's probably battling somebody new right now. Like so, this is not like a big thing. Safleya so Soul is one of the dudes that they're trying to build up to be one of the leaders of this new class, so it only makes sense. In most other classes, they all battle Danny Myers. New Jersey's work battle Danny Myers. Uh, Easy to Black Captain battle Danny Myers. Mike P battle Danny Myers. Nigga, everybody, it's like a rite of passage. This is part of your orientation package. So please do not be surprised that Danny Myers is battling Sophia So I would not be surprised at all. Now, uh, I, when I seen Sophia So and Foots in the two on two, I thought that they would be better because they got a lot of chemistry. They're from the same place. They rep the same league. They're from, you know what I'm saying? They be around each other. So I was thinking, you know, they would be able to put together some crazy heat. But I forgot. You battling against John 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 DNA. Well, well, well. I mean, it might not. That 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 might that night might not want to go how you want it to go. It might not, man. You might. You might come for a 20 and leave with a penny, man. I'm just saying, you know. Oh, that's your man. He get fed shells as well. Everybody around you. They put the switch on y'all that night. They put the switch on y'all that night. But I am, um, I'm seeing the confidence in URL to continue to book y'all. I know this is um, the doings of P. And like I said, I know P gets a lot of flack. People try to give him a lot of shit. But I know he's working hard trying to develop these guys. So I'm um. I'm going to let it happen. Well, what's my saying? Let it happen. I'm going to let it happen. And we're going to see where it's going to go to. Um, that's so, so I would like to see Danny Myers. Obviously, I'd like to see him in some bigger battles. I would think him versus Luke Castro would be a dope summer madness battle. I would hope they finally get this Swamp and Averb shit out the way. Bro, we've been waiting for this shit for a month of Sundays. They need to get Swamp and Averb out the way like yesterday. Like even the promotion. I'm going to do that likes promotion, but this is tiring promotion. They're on each other every day, and I'm not mad. Listen, I see it, I retain it, but I don't even blog or talk about it anymore because it's like, oh, swamp this verb again. Oh, verb this swamp again. I just let it go. I did post a live from one of them, and I think I posted a verb swamp talking about swamp. So they've got everything pre-built for a battle. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know what else they would need to make this one go, but I think hopefully that should be one that uh, we get to see. And then I've been hearing about a uh, hollow versus twerk. I like that. Um, Twerk has been on his, uh, he's been on his shit late, recently as in battle rap. I know his battle with, uh, uh, Jaden, J400, my bad, J400. He got rescheduled, he couldn't do it, or whatever the case may be. I ain't really go too far into it because it is what it is. I got other shit going on. But I heard about it, I heard it's rescheduled for July 9th, so hopefully it happens. Um, him and Hollow, 
Uh, I think that that would be dope because I like when Hollow's on big stages, especially Summer Man. It's his, 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 uh, so he could definitely shake, you know what I'm saying, get busy. And Twerk would be one that would be that would be dope too. Uh, probably be some females, you know what I'm saying, wouldn't mind seeing Hustle and Jazz maybe again. And uh, fucking uh, Ford, no, nah, not Ford, uh, Official's still around. Uh, you know, and there's a lot of other people that get busy too. Forty's still around too. I mean, her last battle was I. I mean, she was mad at me because I spoke about it, but I paid for the motherfucker too. That's what I don't be getting about battle rap. So we could pay for an event when I could get it for free, or I could bootleg it, or I could just wait for somebody to send me the link, or I could just watch it on somebody else's shit. But we pay to support these events because you're in the culture, you're making money off it, you pay to support them. And it's not just her; it's like mad rappers. Like I don't understand how y'all get mad about us talking about an event. That we paid for, you know what I'm saying? If I go to uh, if I go to damn Dairy Queen and they don't make my 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 damn Blizzard right, I could go on Yelp and leave a review. I can. I don't think the CEO of Dairy Queen is gonna be calling me or be tweeting or oh, F I fly that nigga so up because it's just a, it's just an opinion. Like it's just an opinion. That's all it is. I gotta stop being so sensitive. I don't get it, but it is what it is. Um. So yeah, I think that uh, Hollow. And uh, and Hollow and the twerk would be dope. Uh, I've been hearing about Rum Nitty and Cal. I could pretty much see that happen because Cal said he need this amount of time. Rum Nitty, Rum Nitty don't really promote. So when you got a nigga that don't promote at all, and you see him talking about a battle or talking about preparing and shit like that, he's preparing. That nigga, that deposit done. Ching ching, that deposit done hit. Cause this nigga don't be online just promoting for no damn reason. He do got a new song that he's promoting online. I forgot the name of it, but. Uh, yeah, he don't be just online promoting for no goddamn reason. That ain't Rum Nitty. I've been in this shit too long, and I've seen him have some big battles. And I don't see him just online promoting or talking about any battle that ain't going down. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I think it was maybe the Cassidy shit, but Cassidy ain't battling nobody. I mean, Conceited shit. Yeah, Conceited and Cassidy. They're not, really, they're not gonna battle Rum Nitty. I, they don't want that. I, I get it. <laughs> it sounds good, but what sounds good don't usually get found good. Um, Yeah, so that, that could be that. And then, you know, uh, Easy to Blog Captain, you know, everybody keeps talking about him uh, every fucking day of the week. And I really didn't want it to be there, but uh, I've been hearing about him and Geechee Gotti. I did mention it yesterday. He, I think he did put out a couple of IG stories that were saying that his next battle is already booked or whatever the case may be. So we're just going to see it like that. I'm not following every single thing that he do. I'm not blogging on every single tweet, every single like. Like, I, I'm not doing it. I, I don't have time for it, you know what I'm saying? So when something important or any valid data comes out, we'll talk about that. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. Like, we'll see and hear all. <laughs> I know Geechee Gotti is ready and wants that opportunity to send this man to the shadow realm. Like, you did what to who with what? Oh, no, nah, we got to get you out of here. So if that does happen, uh, we would, I'd love to see how it goes. But, you know, there was a... And you know how we all love polls, man. This poll... Pa pause, pause, pause. We all love voting systems. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, Vada. Take that L. Hold on. You ain't exempt. You ain't exempt. Hold on. Hush, la, 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 la. Baptize you in the L. Uh, we all love voting systems and voting styles. And um, it has uh, Easy to Black Captain winning by a lot. Like, still damn near 60 to other people's 10 5, 10 10. Um, you know, he acknowledged it and he said his next battle's locked in. So we'll see what that's going to be. Salute to all of y'all out there. Oh, you know, I'll be talking about some regular shit that happened in the news or is happening at the news towards the end. Casanova gets sentenced today. He's facing 60 years in jail. Ladies and gentlemen, young cats out there that watch me. I know a lot of people that watch me are younger. Y'all out there, make wise decisions because you can make a bad decision and wind up in jail facing 30, 40, 50, 60 years. And trust me, them visits slow down after that first year. That first summer, your girl will probably hold you down. She probably gonna hold you down. You know, send you letters, be on every visit. That second summer? Ask them cats on there about that second summer. Please ask them about that second summer, that third summer, that fourth summer sitting in there. Your girl out. They're gonna break up. She's gonna be out there with her legs in the air. The only person that's gonna be coming to visit you is your mama and probably your kids. A lot of, lot of joints is out. You like laying up with things? You might want to stay out of jail. I'm just telling you as new, I won't go. I got a brother that's finishing up 25. And uh, that's a long time to be away from the streets. So, I mean, y'all out there make some smarter decisions because you're going you to be like Casanova facing 60 years in jail. And uh, the judge is not about to play with him. I promise you that. Tax Stone just got 35. What you think he getting? They hanging cats up for the rest of their natural life. They're not coming home until they on walkers and wheelchairs. W and W. You want to be on a walker? You want to be in a wheelchair when you get out of jail? When you got a chance to do something right now? 
a chance to make something with yourself, a chance to go to school, a chance to get a job, a chance to get a trade, a chance to go to the military, a chance to do a lot of things, and that's the route you want to go? All right. All right, you're going to be locked up with a 43-year-old man that think you cute. <laughs> you better ask them. You better ask around. You, 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 all right, you're going to be getting tested, man. You don't want nobody to put no sugar in your tank, man. You might want to chill. If y'all not built like that, you don't want to be there, man. Stay, stay smart. Stay vigilant out here. But I was talking about that lady in Chicago who had got punched by that man down on Halstead. Shout out to Chicago. Shout out to the west side, south side, all that. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to all the neighborhoods out there. Uh, but, bro, like, got shot, killed. Son got arrested. Her and him gets let out. So now he got a free body and you dead for no reason and your family gonna have to do a fish fry barbecue whatever they can to try to raise some money for you and they putting up pictures talking about he was a father he had a mother he wasn't thinking about none of them when he was doing that that man went to get a cheesesteak and a hamburger and left that spot with some wings whose fault is that <laughs> whose fault is that you crashed all the way out you're gonna punch on that woman and then her son blazed you up you see, your body couldn't handle what your fist ordered. Your fist ordered something your body wasn't ready to handle. You gotta watch that. I done seen two battle rappers get punched. And well, one dude got killed, and this dude got punched in a battle the other day for talking about somebody's mother. Like, y'all gonna have to realize that people don't play about their mothers. And the only thing I'm gonna say about dude is if he would have had a gun and that 14 year old would have been punching his mother, he would have shot him too. That's why I don't feel no remorse about it. Keep your hands to yourself out here in these streets. That's another thing. Niggas put their hands on somebody and wonder why they end up in a box. I don't want no problems with nobody. I'm coming or going, that's it. I don't want nothing. I don't, nah, man, it's about to get hot outside too. You better be safe out there. Uh, battle Rap World, you know, it, I, I continue to try to promote battles, <laughs> to try to promote some of the good things that's going on. I know it's a lot of messy stuff out here and that stuff is, is really consumable and people will watch it. But I, that's just not the mission I'm on. So sometimes I know y'all might feel a way like, oh, he's not doing this or he's not doing that. But it's like, bro, what got me to the next level, y'all know the next level was not, you know, tearing people down and stuff like that. And that's just not what I'm going to do. Now, I could whew, I could every now and then, like if somebody played with me or if I feel like, you know what I'm saying, it is what it is. I could show you my handle, but that's not really what I'm here for. You know what I'm saying? So uh, salute to myself and my brother Showtime SP. Uh, look forward to seeing y'all again. Thank you for watching this content. Well, 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 baptizing, baptizing with the L. I should, I should, I all y'all get some. Yeah, yeah, man. Follow me on the motherfucking gram. You know my shit on fire. 